What's up guys, Corvus95 here and welcome to episode 33 of my Europa Universalis 4 playthrough as England, now Great Britain, in the Mario Nostrum expansion. So on the last episode, we declared war on Moravi, Kilwa, Chokwe, Luba and Mahafali. And in the, at the very end, they attacked me with a 34 stack and a 20 stack. I believe it was, or it might have been a 30 stack and a 24 stack, into my 20 stack, and as it looked like my 20 stack, which is now an 8.5k stack, looked like it was going to get beaten, I managed to get some uh, reinforcements in, so we thankfully won, won those battles, and we're actually getting all of our 80k troops together in this war. We can actually get another 20k army now. Um, let's do template name 20k and we will get 10k. What is it? 8, 2, so 160, no, 115, 4, and 1. Now I want to build this. I suppose we could build it down here. How long would it take to build down here? 213 days to build one. No, to build all of it. Um, sure. It shouldn't take that long. We have our colonies going at the minute. We've just started new ones quite recently. So we should be able to go like that, I think. Let's check the forts. Yeah, we should. If we had a explorer, we could. We don't have one, unfortunately. I don't want to waste military points on that at this point. Can we go there? Yes, we can. Well, let's do that then. Am I going to get there first? Because I need to know that. I'm going to get there on the 7th. They will get there on the 23rd of November. So no, I'm not to go back home. They almost chose to attack into me there. Seems like a ridiculous idea. Our maintain diplomat with our vassal. Or our colonial nation. And what tech, or not tech, ideas did you take? Economics. So you don't have a conquistador. Well, I suppose this isn't a right incognita for you. Army tradition or navy? Army. I need a better general. You want to take how much attrition? 5% attrition, that's fine with me. Because it's obvious they're going to attack into someone. So you're attacking into me. Oh, you clever devil. Um, how fast do you get down there? The 18th. Again, now on the 10th. You will get there on the 7th. Get on the boats. Get out of there. Nice. Thank you for intercepting. That is incredibly helpful. Oh no. I I shouldn't have done that. Okay, they're just fleeing down there, that's fine. Can regroup. Stop! Stop attacking! Why do I keep doing this? Erg! I hit the lock thing. Flee! We're not gonna win that battle. We are gonna win that battle. No, we're not. 
just lost. It's fine. A black flagged army. Come down here, please. Right, you flee. You also flee down here. You stay there. You go there. Well, nineteen K there. Um, let's get that army. You are going to there. And we've took like 30k manpower loss so far. I suppose we spent 20k directly. So I haven't actually took that much damage. Um, you can stay down here. You, your cannon got this. You don't have a cannon, that's why. Okay, so we need to swap out a... We need to get rid of an infantry. We need to give this army a cannon. We'll send you up to here. Send you to here. They are coming down. We should be able to easily win this. What happened to my all our general? Did my other general die? And I just didn't see it. Yes, he did. Well, let's go, another general. Come on. Come on, military. Come on. Oh, that's quite poor. Okay. What happened at. How, stop. Go kill. Go kill. You two, come up a bit. With the 18k stack going in here. I didn't even notice. I just lost 20 prestige because we lost the debate. Just, we had like an 80% chance to win. Um, I need manpower, but you're not going to give me manpower. Thanks a lot. Um, let's just get that one. No. Sure, sure. Sure. 93% chance. I think I should win that. Let's play. And then let's send you to here. You can follow as well. Now probably is the best time to attack though. I'm just getting some power. And now let's attack. Everyone just pile on. We need to get rid of this, of these armies. Right, thank you. Okay, you go there. All the army go there. No, you're one of the ones without general. You go there, and then you come here. And this army come recuperate there, and then the cannon. Are you moving to join? You can join this army. There we go. Take our provinces back. Our two colonies. And yeah, now you can see why I don't do wars very often, because I'm not very good at them. Okay. We'll put... Who's this? Thomas. 
Thomas and George send him over here. Why can I not go that way? It isn't a fork though. I don't understand the fork system still. I don't know how many times I have to fail at the fork system before I'm gonna get it, but... I thought we couldn't rival each other could steal. What happened to not being able to rival each other? We're down to zero man coin. From 55,000. It's gonna take 10 years to recover. I don't know if that was worth it. Okay, let's do Tanjo. Probably best if we eliminated someone first of all. So he has no siege ability. So we should have switched those two around, realistically. Um, explore East China Sea Coast. Thank you. Them up. We should probably be using the mercs, if I'm being honest. But we haven't been to war for forever, so there was no reason to have mercs when they're not at war. Because it just costs more than regular troops, and you're not really using them for anything. So we siege that down. So you go there. Oh, that's why we couldn't, because Tareg like incognita. And they have a fort here. Please don't be an army standing on it. You move up there. You move up to here. Okay. So it's 14k here. It will go river crossing. Where do you have rivers to? Lim. Do you have one to Ini in Hambe? You have one to Limpona. So you don't want to have one to there. So I can go here and then go there. We've discovered Japan. Age of Wonders, 10 Prestige, Ryukyu. So we'll attack from this side and then reinforce, I think. I think that's the best idea. Let's put Thomas in charge, or Tarleton. Tarleton. Let's put Thomas in charge. Okay. So that's locked, and now move you in. Terrain penalty, that's fine. Good. So you go that way, you go that way. Let's actually put Thomas in charge of you. Actually, no, we need Thomas in charge of this army, realistically. And we'll just have Tarleton in charge of this one. Okay. Now, Ravi wants peace. War reparations, not good enough. I want some land, even if it's just the coastline. 50 Diplo, it's not the worst thing. My Inquisitor just died. So let's get a missionary strength guy. Are we doing military power or military focus? Yes, we are. So what do I realistically want from this war? I want as much coastal land as possible.
I need to occupy this to take it. They'd only need 27 more score for these two, which may be all I take at this point. We can take some later. Zimbabwe. to jump in in case we get attacked. I'm going to take some attrition there, which sucks, but there we go. It's not a fort, so it's not necessary to jump on top of it. Let's bring you up to here. I actually gave up on it just before it fell. Ship durability we do not need. And none of that's really useful until um, we get to discipline, so I'm just going to take the next military tech instead. They've attacked. Jump in. Come on. Thank you. How did we roll so badly that we were going ruffle stone? There we go. Thank you. We were just getting smashed over and over. Um, send you back. And then give you Thomas. And send you to siege that. And we should be on enough war score to do peace. Yes we are. Is that all I want? I sh may be able to get war reps? No. I think that's good enough for me. Get some more coastline. We'll eventually make our way up here. This war has been horrible on me. Let's do it. There we go. So we've got our two new provinces. Let's increase the autonomy. And let's start the coring process. Let's bring all our armies back. Send one there, and then one down to here. And that was horrible. We lost so much manpower. Like, we probably lost... Well, okay, we didn't lose that much. We lost, like, 45k manpower, which is a lot, I will admit. We didn't lose 55 though, because we built a 20 stack army. We actually built 21k troops during that war. So, we, we're going to go down by 20,000, no matter if we're in the war or not. Now we just have to let our armies recharge a bit. And yeah, that wasn't as nice as it could have been. How is everything else going? We're exploring up here. I don't want you to pause, so let's just lose some prestige. I've been losing quite a lot of prestige lately. Korea's doing well. How much is the next military tech going to cost? Four, 510. So not that much. Nice discount there. Well, it's because we're behind time, but a nice discount nonetheless. It really is just powerhouses in India at the minute. Conversion successful. And let's move on to Cape. So let's have a look at the religion map mode. Just so I know what I can give away. So you I gave away, you I gave away. You aren't the right religion, but you fetishist, so you're showing up showing up as a different colour. Um you I can give away now. 
as can you be given away and you be given away. We've we'll given away the Maldives already, and you're not converted yet, you're not. All this is already given away, and then this is our colonial nation, the Catholic province over here. Oh, Portugal, isn't that in my colonial region? No, it's not. You're lucky. Why is it changed name? Why is it now called Fenkaya? It's called Lenny. Okay, well, that's going to be the end of this episode, guys. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like. Hit that subscribe button as well. We've re recently reached 26 subscribers, which is a nice improvement on last week, where we were only on 23. So thank you guys who've subscribed and those who already were subscribed. And from me, Corvus95, thank you guys so much for watching, and goodbye.